grow and then whatever like right so the guy so the guy's like cool right so he he goes out he finances a, a shitload more he buys a whole bunch more acreage right white fong food companies ends up going behind this guy's back while they've already signed the contract apparently they were sharing confidential like harvest uh videos and stuff like that like you know proprietary it's basically proprietary knowledge and stuff about their harvest techniques and stuff of like that but like processing the peppers and junk they were sharing it with competitors to the underwood ranches people and they were trying to lure away one of the like executives from like the like the vice like the vice ceo or vice president away from underwood ranches in order to like you know they were going to pull him off and like whatever put in something else so the guy the head guy finds out about it he finds out that all this shady shit they've been trying to do uh you know they break the contract he says he sues them for 23 million dollars he just Ooh. won like a couple like a couple months ago apparently or last year he won That's the spicy. lawsuit like they paid out 23 million dollars <laughs> so Huai Fong Food put out like a thing a while ago, and I thought that was why that like they said, oh, you know, we're having a bad pepper harvest. It's the weather. It's the supply chain. That's why we're not getting out enough out. That's why there's going to be a shortage. But no, um, it might have been those things. But one of the bigger reasons is because nobody will sell peppers to them anymore. They're having trouble getting peppers because nobody will will deal with them because they're pieces of shit apparently. <laughs> like because of that whole deal, of shady business practices. So that's, yeah, oh, yeah, that's so fucking crazy, it's fucking nuts. I was like, holy shit. So then you some people were saying you can forever, like months, months. Well, and months they were saying they're saying sriracha. you can buy the the sriracha sauce. You can buy it directly from the Underwood Ranch like their website they're, they're in like california or something like or Cal somewhere over there somewhere on the west coast but you can buy it directly from them and apparently it's as good if not better than the white fong food ones i ordered some i'm gonna try, I'm gonna try oh, it sometimes just get know. here sometime I, I this week. Sriracha. it's a staple just yeah but it was like every, i was like that's every nuts. rice dish i have has a little sriracha because i couldn't find it i was like Ooh, i couldn't find I it for, i haven't been able though. to find it for I months tried that like you can't find it in the regular store, store foods like near in my area. I went to like the I went to the H Mart. I went to like the places where they sell like all the Korean, like the Korean markets and Asian food stores. Nothing. Couldn't find any Huai Fong food. The, Huai that Fong one. food. Uh, I couldn't find any. Of that. There's a there was other ones, but they weren't the they're same. Like they weren't that one, uh, which has always been the best one. But uh, you... yeah, that was the whole reason is that apparently Huai Fong food just fucked themselves over because of their shitty business practices. <laughs> Did you? Uh... You guys see the fucking new Ninja Turtles trailer today? Yeah, it looked cool. Looks fucking awesome. Bits of it, like, sorry. It looks awesome. The fucking cast, phenomenal, and like the fact that they're like young teenagers. I think it's gonna be hilarious. Yeah, yeah. like they use like the Kids. actors, the young actors. Like that was cool. Yeah. Yeah. They, well, in the portrayal of the Ninja Turtles, they're not like badass. They're kids. Like it's fucking yeah. yeah well, it's gonna be hilarious. We got like a snapshot of Bebop and Rocksteady, and I was like, they looked fucking. Do you know awesome. who, you you know who see, Bebop like, and Rocksteady super... are? Uh, it's Seth Rogen and and John Cena. Oh, yeah, is, uh, yeah John Cena's Cena, rock steady. Yeah. I hope I hope we get to see like young. Oh, so it's animated, like, badass. Yeah, yeah. Jackie Chan is Splinter. See, yeah, I hope we get to see a younger like badass Splinter like bust out some crazy. I hope shit, so too. Like, fuck shit up. I want to see. Well, because they're kids, man. They look like they're young teens. Like, yeah. So I'm saying, like, what would Spl like Splinter would be like? I mean, we have seen badass like, Splinter though. We Turtles one, 40s? he takes out fucking Shredder. I mean, yes, but like that's like that's older. You yeah. know, I'm saying like he probably be, anyway. He's got to be like in his fifty. No, I think he's probably dude. He can barely like move at the beginning. Like he's fucking right, right. I so made it's the like, funny. Yeah, saying, like, in, <laughs> I was hoping for rubber suits again. That's the younger <laughs> version. Young yeah, I mean suits. anything, anything, anything's better than that. The Michael Bay stuff. Yeah, oh, the Michael Bay stuff is awful. awful. Even my kid, uh, I like. <laughs> there, there was like, did you guys remember the TM TMNT came probably maybe like two thousand and seven, two thousand and eight. Awesome, great the movie. Fox one, the one on Fox. Um, I don't know. Are you talking? I'm not. About no, no, no. It's a, the movie, animated movie. Fucking great. My kid loves it. We watch. Oh yeah, yeah. We watch yeah, it yeah. all the time the together. CGI one? He loves it. So I was like, okay, listen, maybe like. You know, I we we tried the 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 old ones a little bit too slow for him. I get it. Secret of the Uzi liked a little bit more, but still a little slow. So I tried the Michael Bay ones, and my kids like what? The? Like my kids like those aren't Ninja Turtles. Those aren't Ninja <laughs> He's Turtles. like, ah! well, they all look like sloths. Yeah. They look like fucking green sloths. Yeah. Like they the, fucking the, the Nickelodeon. The Nickelodeon show was really good. The one that was on Fox like a long time. TMNT that was on Fox. That was a, that was good, a good one, one too. Yeah, for a while. 
the um, one the rise the of the ones. teenage mutant ninja turtles the, the one that's kind of newish that I, 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 the most recent one was fucking weird like, i'd like I, it though I they got so many it, like, they the, the cgi one was really good the like, was the one good. that they do now they've like they use like you see you're like ray fillette is in it and fucking uh gang is frog and shit like they use all the characters yeah which they the comic books are wild now that the fucking last ronin right now that's good last ronin was amazing um well, they they're greenlit too. Like, there's going to be a second, a continuation. It's like something. Old Man Logan, Ninja but with Ninja Turtles. Yeah, with, with Michelangelo. And then spoiler, it's oh, that's cool. yeah. All the other ones are gone. Yeah, yep. And it's, in the, it's like a future, like a poss- possibility future, like yeah. a what if future kind of badass. That's cool. Um, it's pretty good. Is he hardened? Hardened Michelangelo? It's hard as yeah. fuck. Hard. Yeah, his that's brothers cool. all if we watch all his brothers fucking die. Yeah, like, dude, it's it's really good. Yeah, it's and like the fun. beginning, you don't know around. who the, who he is exactly. You know what I mean? Like it's yeah. it's good. It's, it's a, a fucking. Spoiler. But it's yeah, I spoiled it. It's dope. I shouldn't spoil it. Like that. Um, but yeah, that's good. But no, like even the the one that's in the you know TMT Prime kind of one now is really weird because they brought back what's his face that the uh, what the fuck's the shark guy the um shark guy. Uh, yeah, the one shark mutant. He was like a. Oh, fuck what is it he was in the the fighters he was in the tmnt fighters <laughs> like i feel like i feel like um, I, there was a missed opportunity for a good crossover between the street sharks and the mutant ninja turtles no i can't do that teenage mutant ninja turtles. yeah i mean street sharks kind of proper- suck though toys some, were cool T- a weird TV show yeah, they street to... sharks yeah TV was the, was wasn't that the thing? i remember i remember the show i remember like the sharks but i don't came out like street sharks and uh, and biker mice from mars those were kind of came out yeah, around the same time. I remember time. that one. Biker Mice from Mars was a yeah. little better, I think. Street Sharks had better I think toys. Biker Mice Mice came out before Street Sharks. Did. It was dope. But no, like they, they made the shark guy. They made the shark dude. Like he now he's like they reference him, but he's like now What's he's his... like some sort of I can't remember. They said it and I can't, I read it the other day, but it's like he's like now like a a cosmic horror, like some kind of weird, <laughs> crazy, insane threat that's just like he is everywhere and nowhere devouring all before him like something really nuts but space it's, shark it's cool is the name space shark no um i'd have to look at the uh, team. armagon the roster yeah that's it that's um, the one I, he must be newer the like there was never a toy of him or anything i th- i think there was not back when we were kids i would have had it no way. Armagon. Like I remember, yeah, but like he was in TMNT Fighters. I remember he was in TMNT Fighters. Oh, that's cool. But the, the the TMNT, tournament fighters. TMNT, TMNT fighters, fighters, fighters came out later though. Here's a here's a good one. Best what's the best toy you guys had when you were a kid? Like you, your you favorite. think of like the toy where you're like, shit. That like that was the one, like maybe that'd be worth some money now. Like if I would have hang hung on to it, or you just your favorite one. What was your favorite toy? You know what mine was? Like yeah, I vividly remember it. The um uh, the fucking I got the Power Ranger like dag green ranger dagger flute. Cool. Oh yeah. I don't know that one. Yeah, uh yeah. I fucking love that when I got that as a kid. That and my little fucking macho man muscle dummy that you could wrestle. Oh, I remember like that my one. two yeah. fucking favorite Look on my nose, brother. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh she those never... are my two fucking favorite toys growing up. Um, I'd have to stretch a brain to remember some toys. My fa- my two favorites were Slash, my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Slash, and my fucking Spider Man animated series Venom, where you could remove he had a rubber mask and you could take it off and it would be fucking Eddie Brock underneath. That was my oh, fucking, that's cool. Yeah, and then this one, I fucking this one, I've had this one since I was a little kid too. Fucking Spider Man Black Studio. Is it hard having a, a son and you're just like because you're just like I want to buy him all the toys. I do you buy more toys for yourself. Uh, I buy them all the time. Right. It's a fucking problem. And the, right. the worst thing ever to happen is he likes all the stuff I like. Yeah. Like, it's a problem. So you're just like, you're getting, you're just, well, you're, you're, it's that they say like, oh, be the parent that you needed. And you're like, this is what I need. Oh, yeah. I need all the toys. I actually, like, it, <laughs> things got a little wild and I, like, I've now become like the disciplinarian of the house. And Ooh, it was really bad oh, for shit. a bit. And it, it, we've like, we're coming out on the good side now. Like he's learned and it's really cool to see. It's it's fucking weird, but it's cool to see like the stuff you implement starting to like pay off. It's yeah. fucked. Like what? 
like he because jess when jess is home she can't do anything with him really she's almost bedridden right now because she's having all the issues with the relaxing and the pain in her hips and everything so i got the nintendo switch and i bought him some games and all of a sudden it's all he wanted to do 24 7 yeah, game, game, like game, that's game. it. Just and like he didn't want to go outside anymore. He didn't want to do anything. And then I like and I've been working. I've been picking up a lot of extra work. And I didn't really it didn't clue in until one day where I was like, hey man, like you want to go box? Like we go, come down in the garage and we box. I got him little gloves, little fucking helmet, and we box. We have a great time. We do shit like that. We go play hockey. And he's like, no, I'm like no, 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 no. I don't want to do any of that shit. I want to play. I'm playing Mario. I'm playing Mario. And finally, I realized I was like, oh, like this kid hasn't been outside in two days. I don't think like this is. So I just oh, like he 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 threw he spazzed out when I was like you're not playing you're not playing video games today lost his fucking mind and I literally was like okay it's gone packed it all up fucking took it away and for fucking <laughs> I didn't let him like for two weeks every day I want to play Switch I want to play Switch I was like no man it's gone it's gone it's gone finally after two weeks he didn't ask me to play Nintendo Switch and then the next day you know what I mean he walks up and he's like hey dad like you know, do you think we could play Nintendo switch, do something like that? I was like this weekend, you know, if you're good and you listen, you can play Nintendo switch weekend comes, he comes up to me fucking Saturday. He goes, dad, can, can we play Nintendo switch? And I was like, yeah, you can play Nintendo switch for 20 minutes. Dad's going to set a timer. I put a timer up on the TV, sat there, played Nintendo switch. Timer goes off after 20 minutes, presses pause and puts the controller down. He's like, okay, dad, I'm done. I almost Ooh, cried. Nice. I was like, nice. I did this. I did this. You're like, play I another won. five. <laughs> I know. Right? I wanted to. I want to be like, just play all fucking day. You listen to me. But yeah. sorry, Dan. What, Dan Zell, tell us your toys, buddy. What, what, what's your favorite? <clears throat> I was a Lego man. I love oh, Lego. Yeah, you didn't Zell, you fucking Zell Uncle Cray have, Lego? He had, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he had the best fucking Lego. Dude, I got what was your all, favorite Lego set like, that you had? At one time, I had the Jurassic Park Lego set. Oh, that's pretty I specifically cool. remember that set. That's pretty cool. But yeah, I'm a, I was huge, huge Lego. I had fucking bins and bins. Did and you bins get the pl- Did you get the police station Lego set? I don't remember. No, no police station. I don't I think. That one. That and like the castles. I got, with the I got all the Star Wars, Jurassic shit. Park. Um, Star Wars was huge at that time because the episode one had just come out. Like start like the rebirth of Star Wars. So oh, fucking cool. Star Wars was everywhere. So I got, yeah, you get like the X-Wing. What do you want for Christmas? Oh. All I want is Star, Star Wars Lego. That's it. Star Wars Lego. Dude, yeah. I have vivid, like I never, like I got like just fucking bulk Lego, basically. Like doll, <laughs> like so whatever was left. I never so got the fucking They have 5,000 red bl- bricks. That's yeah, it. <laughs> so then I, like I have vivid memories of like going over to Zell's, him having all these fucking Jedis with the lightsaber and being like, can I have one of these? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? have yeah take one i'd be like the whole series okay i have the best lego like that was my guy i played with yeah that's cool little brown cape okay dan Mm. do they even have toys when you're a kid or is it just like sticks and rocks yeah (laughs) (laughs) pretty much I mean, yeah, I was an outdoor like kid. He, he like had a I ball was, and a spoon. Yeah, I think I had a lot of. I was a lot of outdoor kids. We had a creek by my house, so it's like when you're a kid, like yeah, you got a creek. Like fuck, that's it. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, I I was a, I was a Transformers kid. I had a bunch of Transformers. Like, so that uh, makes sense because Transformers. I feel like my I just missed like when I was a kid. I just missed the big wave. So that would have made sense. Well, we had Beast Wars. I, when I, when I, I was big in a Transformers. Oh, yeah, Beast Wars was good. We had Beast yeah, Wars. I, well, now even before that, because I remember, I remember the, I vividly, because it's probably one of my core memories. I vividly remember watching the 1987, uh, not when it came out, but like on VHS, like after a while, in the 90s. Like I watched the, the Transformers movie and watching Optimus Prime die and freaking yeah, out sad. and like running up to tell my parents like Optimus Prime died and they're just like what the fuck who is Optimus Prime like what are you talking about why are you crying yeah, I, I had like, Optimus Prime is dead I kind of had a similar situation because my <laughs> my grandparents owned an old fucking like movie store a pizza place in the movie store so I had all these old VHS's right. so I used to watch Transformers and like the G.I. Joe the 80s was it 87 or 88 the G.I. Joe movie Mm, fucking nash bridges whatever his name is was 
Falcon, like it was Don dope. Johnson. Don Johnson was Falcon. Yeah. Like that was a good fucking movie. Yeah, the fucking the the Transformers movie is still fucking yeah. Cops, man. man, you remember I, cops I, fighting crime in a future time? If I ever <laughs> that was a fucking great yeah yeah, yeah yeah. Uh, if I if I ever mention I'm talking about the Transformers movie in conversation, I'm ref- I'm referring to that movie. There are no other Transformers movies <laughs> to be. That is the only Transformers. There's no movie Michael Bay Transformers ever... movies. There's no Michael Bay. There are Transformers no Michael Bay Transformers. Both those guys. Dude, fucking shit I will all say this: childhood. the first it's Michael Bay. Transformers it's got Robert Stack okay. as Ultra Magnus and fucking uh, who else was in that one? Um, Leonard Nimoy as Galvat- as Galvatron. That's cool. And Orson Welles is fucking is fucking Unicron. Uh, so, and the Weird Al dare to be stupid on the soundtrack, <laughs> fucking banging soundtrack. Ah, oh, so good, amazing. Yeah, but yeah, I just I remember. Yeah, I had a bunch of Transformers as a kid, and I. Who's I your favorite Transformer now? Uh, my favorite Transformer. Yeah, uh, it's probably Grimlock. Like, it's probably one of the Dinobots. Like, I probably Grimlock. Like, yeah. It's I don't cool even know who Grimlock is. Who the fuck is Grimlock? Is the T Rex dinosaur? Is the T Rex transformer? It's the Dinobots. Who was the Raptor one? That was that was Dinobot. Oh, that, yeah, it's Dinobot yeah, from Wars. Beasties. But Beast Wars. But the, Beasties. But the OG Dinobots. It's like Grimlock and Slag. Oh, right. Hey, listen, Dinobots badass. Sweet. Dinobot was awesome. Dinobot was badass. Yeah, he's cool. Grimlock. Well, Grimlock gentlemen, is cool as fuck. I think we have to end this one. You having a baby? You got you got poop? Nope. Have it might baby? be go time, my friends. Might be go time. Yep. Awesome. Right. Getting the text. Uh. Yep. <laughs> All right. Did you have a contraction. Um, as we always you? say, as we always say at the end of this, and we'll I'll fill you in later. As we always say at the end of these things, keep those eyes on the sky. We'll be back. Gotta go. Week. We gotta See go. Bye. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I know it's annoying to watch these broken up in ten minute segments, but here's the next one over here. Or if you want to watch the whole thing uncut and after hours, just click this link to our website and uh, give us a donation. You get full access to it on Patreon. Anyways, thanks, guys. Enjoy the next video.